Alright, so this is a video where I'm doing a tier list. It's gonna be the best video. <sighs> Alright, let's do this. Let's do this tier list on SpongeBob characters from some random person on the internet. Well, let's do it. Um, already, I think this. So I'm pretty sure her name's Abigail Marge. I feel like so I don't really know her. She's just a background character to me. So I'm gonna put her D tier D tier. Um sadly, because I don't really know who uh, I don't really I can't really think of like a, a memorable moment for her off the top of my head. So, Barnacle Boy, um, Barnacle Boy has some pretty good lines in the show. It's not me, old coot! So, I'm putting him in the B tier. He's not as good as Mermaid Man. Uh, in terms of, like, action-wise and, like, being completely interactive, I feel like Barnacle Boy definitely is in the B tier. Uh, no disrespect to, um, Ernest Borgnine's passing, but, I don't know, Mermaid Man's a bit, eh. It's a bit sluggish, so uh, yeah. Uh, so far, he makes it clear that I think he's. You know what? I already said he's funnier, so I'm putting him in the A tier. Um, this random fish that I don't know the name of. Seen her a lot of times in the show, but she's also going in D tier. Um, let's see. Um. Beats here. I was never really that big of a fan of Pi. I mean, I always really like this gimmick, but like, honestly, it's kind of eh, in my opinion. French narrator or the Cyclops or whatever. Uh, looks like it's a yeah. It looks like it's a picture from uh from Feral Friends. So I I'm guessing that that's uh it's the Cyclops. So. Okay, in terms of the Cyclops, actually, you know what, I'm just gonna say he's a French narrator. Uh, it's A tier. <laughs> I don't know. Always, always great, always great, you know, always great. Uh, this guy, <laughs> this guy is actually pretty, uh, funny from his appearances, and even from that one, I think that's from Boating Bodies, actually, so, yeah. He's C tier, C tier. Uh, this guy, I don't really know mm, C tier as well. Uh, a bit on the lower side of the C tier, to be honest. Um, Hans. Oh, B tier. He's, uh, he's kind of cool. He's, he's cool. Uh, he doesn't really appear that much outside the theme song in the show. But, you know, he's actually really <laughs> sometimes can be a really interesting character. Harold over here. Alright, I know him. Oh, oh yeah, also, one of these two is named Billy. I think this guy's name is Billy, but this one's Harold. Uh, he's a bit snarky. Uh, in terms of episodes like Midlife Crustacean and Band Geeks. Come on. Move it! Um, but, you know what? Sometimes his snarky comebacks are pretty hilarious, so I'm gonna, I'm putting him in the B tier. First background fish and be in the B tier to get a good grade. This guy has no relevance whatsoever to the show, so I'm putting him in the D tier. Again, no disrespect to the character, not like I hate him, but it's just like, eh, I don't really care about him that much. So, uh, here's Perch Perkins. Uh, and he doesn't really have that many funny moments, to be honest. He's, uh, kind of just, eh. But I would put him in the, uh, probably in the, the B tier, probably because I really do like his voice. D. Bradley Baker, his voice actor, does a really good job, to be honest, of, uh, his, just doing his voice in general. It's really, really fascinating, uh, and I, I really do, uh, like it, uh, so yeah. Oh, Triton, oh, oh, yeah, Neptune, yeah, of course. Uh, we have Neptune. Uh, he was a jerk in the Clash of Triton, to be honest. 
but I think he belongs in the C tier to be honest. He's not a character that I really like, but he's he's okay. Larry, uh, A tier. He gets he's very underused in the series. I have to be honest. Larry is a character that I think definitely needs more attention. He's a guy who's really chill. Again, he's, he's voiced by Doug Lawrence, and uh, he also voices Plankton, which I'll we'll get to later on. Uh, so, yeah, he's probably one of my favorite characters in the show overall. Uh, automatically D tier, for uh, reasons that I've already explained. Man Ray is skin in the, uh, the B tier. He's, he's another snarky guy. He's another snarky uh, villain. Uh, in the show, it's, it's really awesome. He's like Harold, just right next to. It's it's really cool. Uh, we have Bubble, Bubble Bass. Uh, I'm not that big of a fan of his uh, his newer appearances, but he 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 belongs in the B tier. Uh, <clears throat> Fred. Uh, just because of the meme. I'm not that big of a fan of my, like, meme. So, uh... Sorry, Fred, but you, you're going in the C tier. Old Man Jenkins. And, and that's not out of, like, the fact that I just don't think it's funny. I just think that it's been overused meme. And it kind of ruins my perspective on the character as a whole. Uh, Old Man Jenkins. A tier. He, he's, a, he's a good man. <laughs> He deserves some respect. Uh, C tier, only because I I remember her at least a little bit more than these people. <clears throat> Pe oh, I'm not Petri the pirate. We're getting him. Uh, Pangy the pirate though. He's getting going to the to the uh, C tier. I don't really know why he's here. I don't know. I mean, the theme song's cool, but. <laughs> Doesn't really have any other appearances besides the one year she's untied, so th that's why he's going C tier. And also Unreal State, but that's not the voice. Uh, Apache the Pirates going in the B tier. Uh, Dirty Bubble, he's going in the B tier. Not that not that big of a fan of uh of Dirty Bubble, so he's a B. Then again, he's on the same level as Man Ray, so... Eh. Uh, there's a Nat, who's in Plankton's regular. At least he had his own episode before Fred got his own. So, uh... Hmm. I feel kind of bad for him. You know, he lives a terrible life according to Plankton's regular, so... I'm putting him in the A tier. Wait, that's out pity, though. Uh... B tier, but on the upper side of the B tier, this guy who uh, <laughs> is known for his appearance in Clams, uh, he's he's going to be in the B. I'm gonna run out of things that could be in the B tier. To be honest, these characters are cool. Uh, this guy, <laughs> I'll uh, didn't he have parent? Wasn't he the guy that said uh? You try to kill you us, to and kill then us. something smells. Because if he, if it is, then he's getting an A. That's a really good joke, but I don't know, uh, A. Because um, <laughs> oh, Revenge of the Flying Dutchman. No, Flying Dutchman. Uh, B tier. He's gonna be Abigail Marge. Wait, no. <laughs> this time around. The, these two characters look the exact same. Why do they look the exact same? But uh, other than that... Uh, D. Gary automatically uh, S. First S tier. He's a... Uh, he's very underused. He should be... <laughs> he should be one of the three main characters of the show. <laughs> Like he's a uh, he, he he should be way bigger than he is. Um, Karen. Oh, Karen. Oh, oh yeah, A. Yeah, A. <laughs> you're getting an A. You're you're great. 
uh, put on the upper side of A, actually. Um, Mr. Krabs, oh, automatically D tier. I, I, he's the worst character in, in my opinion. He is not a good character. But, uh, I mean, <laughs> he's gonna be the only main character that's, uh, in the, who's, uh, below a C, I think. Uh, uh alright, puts him in the, uh, in C. He's gonna see. Um, this is Puff. Eight tier. No. Uh. Unfortunately, I think I have to give him C, but on the upper side of the C, of the C tier, because um, she's a. Sometimes she can go a bit too overboard, like in uh, in Demolition Doofus. But sometimes she is, she is very pleasant, uh, and she can be funny at times, she's just not too great of a character, in my opinion. Pearl, uh, <laughs> unfortunately C too, cause uh, she's a bit stale, but not as bad as the, well, the people in the D tier, obviously. Uh, Plankton is going in oh i just so not for a minute of course see uh, of course s tier yes he's my favorite character he's my favorite character overall in the series he's he's just, he's just amazing like he's 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 just awesome in general Need hatred. <laughs> sandy is getting uh b tier uh, even though many people would disagree, I think Sandy would belong in the B tier, because he, because she, she, because she is really cool. She's, she's very tough in a way, very Texan. Uh, who is realistic fish head? So, uh, well, you know what, if she, it's gonna be a realistic fish head. He's gonna go along with Perch Perkins, so B tier. SpongeBob is going in the um nah. Unfortunately for the main character of the show, he's gonna be in the C tier. Cause he's not that great. Well not actually B B, why not? In the lower side of the B though. Squidward is going to be in the A tier. Uh he can sometimes get some unpleasant appearances like in uh Little yellow book, but most of the time you can be cool, so that's why I'm picking him from A tier. All right, last two, last two. All right, uh, Squilliam, Squilliam, Fancy Son, uh, A tier on one Squidward. Hopefully, Squidward would be okay with that. Uh, Tom. Finally, uh, well, uh, hmm, B, why not B? All right, so those are my uh, final opinions. Uh, link in the description if you want to check this one out for yourself. What do you pick? Uh, I personally am okay with my opinions. So yeah, with that said, I'm, I'm out. Yeah.